Hello fellow gear horse. Today I have the Ultima OTB Maritime Assault Boot. This is the mid-cut in the multicam pattern. Now I have these three pairs of shoes here to compare it to. Ultima Maritime Assault, some old school PF Flyers, and some Vans old school skate. And I have these two to compare because if you can look at the style of the shoe, it's very similar box toe canvas upper very old school type of look the ultima obviously having a bit a little more modern fabric and technology compared to the more old school style here's the box it comes in pretty standard shoe box nothing special same little paper inserts and nothing else the ultima shoe you can see here it has a instead of a traditional canvas like this kind of shoe it's more like a cordura definitely more heavy duty more robust than a converse or vans or pf flyer so definitely be more durable and more weather resistant as well this probably has a bit of water resistant built into it now i have used it while it was raining and it worked pretty well my feet were pretty dry now granted i was not completely submersed but it held up pretty well and my feet were dry and you can see that i definitely have been wearing these shoes for for about over a month now pretty rigorously every day you can see the bottom is all dirty the tread pretty good held up really well in the wet weather so i wasn't slipping and sliding kind of like some other the more flat type of canvas shoe really robust sole as well i did do a small trek in it it wasn't bad obviously not as comfy as a full outdoor shoe but it held its own very very well very robust toe design here with this rubber i did use these while riding motorcycle and if you know if you ride a bike typically on the left foot this area here while you're shifting on your on your bike definitely gets a lot of abuse and didn't tear or anything which is always always a good sign flat type laces pretty standard stuff i do like the cool coyote eyelets there for the laces they do say ultima on it nice small little detail you do have these two little drainage areas here you can see it's it's part of the softer fabric and you get that on both sides on the back we have this loop here so if you're putting the shoe on you can grab this and pull it tight now i don't like that it's 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 really large you can see it kind of opens up like that I do wish it was a little bit smaller maybe if it was kind of sewn right here and having like that would have been a lot better because this just you kind of really want to yank out this and some people did give me some feedback that this did tear on theirs i had no problem and i and i really yanked on it but you can see cosmetically it just kind of looks funky by flopping out like that the inside we have this spacer mesh type of fabric here pretty comfy breathes pretty well definitely and you got some padding there too versus like a pf flyer which is just fabric definitely no moisture working wicking going on there you get some of that action here which is nice same thing on the tongue and the inside this actually that's really liked it felt way more premium than i expected the inside sole the insert is pretty nice it's a pretty cushiony rubber feeling interior much better than a a standard style really flat like on a vans or converse so that was nice and being solid rubber type of material it's not gonna absorb water which is nice comfort wise cushion pretty nice i mean for for a canvas type of you know old school type of looking shoe which i like so it does give it a more casual look and of course being multicam looks makes it look way more badass than a typical converse definitely stands out it's it's surprisingly got a lot of punch for for what it is being a simple canvas type box toe shoe so i've always liked the simple type of canvas shoe but want something a little more modern and obviously multicam is cool and they also now have it they offer it in multicam black so if you're wanting the more darker route you can opt to get that color everybody's asking me how does it fit should i get the true to size or should i get something smaller bigger what's the deal this is a size 12 
I wear size 12 in my Solomons. These PF Flyers are a US 12. These Vans, 11 and a half. On the Vans, I opted a half size smaller. And we compare size here. The PFs and the Altimas are about the same size. And the Vans, about the same as well, slightly shorter because they are the 11 and a halfs. Generally the, the, the vans run a little bit bigger, which is why I opted for the smaller size. Now, the only thing I will address, and this is something I, I typically suffer when I wear Converse and the vans, is I get a lot of toe rub, and specifically for me on my left foot and not on the right foot. So on this guy here, I get a lot of toe rub. So lengthwise, my foot's okay. You may want to opt for a wider shoe. Altima does offer, which is nice. If you got a little bit of rub, don't order a larger size, get the wide size. Really robust shoe. This fabric is top notch. Same kind of fabric you would see on your plate carrier or rucksack, assault pack. Pretty damn comfy. If you tend to have a little bit wider feet, definitely opt for the wide size and you will not regret it. Been in contact with Altima to return this pair they have a 60 day comfort guarantee i am taking advantage of that and i'm going to get the wide versions of this shoe i will add that video onto this one with my feedback to let you know if i'm getting any kind of toe rub great shoe you can find them online anywhere from 80 to 95 bucks <laughs> really affordable much cheaper than a junkier pair of nikes and they just look so damn cool i mean you can wear them with jeans Wear them under cry pants, wear them with shorts. They're just a good looking shoe. Ultima definitely hit a home run with these. If you're into the old school type of looking shoe, I mean, this is just a, such a throwback to old school shoe, which I which I love, but in the multicam flavor. Definitely digging these. So I will add on after this clip is over to when I get the new ones, and I'll give you the feedback and see how the wides fit. This has been Ultima. OTB Maritime Assault boot and mid cut. Great shoe, great styling, affordable. What's what's not to love? And of course, in multicam and also available at multicam black. And they out for wide sizes. Thanks for watching. Be sure to leave a comment, like, subscribe, all that cool stuff. All right, guys. So I got my Ultima OTBs back from Ultima after I did an RMA. So remember previously in the first part of the video, I had the shoes, my toes were rubbing here a little bit and kind of not really super comfortable. So I contacted Ultima and they make these in wide and I should have gotten the wider ones to begin with. Now that I've been wearing these for quite a few weeks now, it took about one or two weeks to send them back and get them back. Um, no problems, they're a hundred percent perfect really they never I never got any more rubbing on my toes so I would say it's more of a an ordering error on my part typically I don't buy wide shoes but for these it ended up being that I needed the wides and it's been great so far so a couple things I want to note a couple little modifications that I made on my personal pair I changed out the laces more of a visual thing I'm going with a round more round type versus a flat type you can see on the tongue here I sewed some Velcro on on the front then added our Beardman patch on there, a little Mark 2.5 Mini PVC. On the back here, if you remember, this webbing was pretty loose and kind of flopping around. So I got some adhesive, some pretty strong adhesive, and stuck it on there. So now it stays in there pretty well, doesn't flop around. I did get some new insoles for these shoes, not because they were uncomfortable, it's just something I've been used to. I pretty much always drop a more orthopedic insole in all my shoes no matter what the manufacturer is like i said there's nothing wrong with the stock ones it's just i've gotten so used to having ortho inserts that it's just something that i i gotta use but 